GSB, the official banking partner of the CSGN, the only bank you'll ever need. Visit mygsb.bank for more information. The 89th Connecticut Open presented by GSB has reached its last day of action. There are some big scores at the top of the leaderboard, but just one will walk away the winner. Starting the day on top in the final group is two-time defending champion Peter Ballo and co-leader David Pastor. Not far behind, shooting A under through the first two days are both Brett Stegmeier and Casey Pine. Ballo would start the day off right with a birdie courtesy of this putt. It would not go unanswered as Pastor comes right back with a birdie of his own on hole three. Flashing to the other group, thanks to this eagle putt on seven, Stegmeier would hop into the co-leader spot. Pine would finish up a two under front nine to stay in the mix, but it would be Pastor and Stegmeier tied for the lead at 13 under as they make the turn. Brett stayed scorching with the putter as he knocks in this birdie putt on 13 to start to build a lead for himself. Former winner Cody Pellandino shot a 7 under 64, and both Pine and Pastor were keeping the pressure on Stegmeier with a few to play. After a bogey on 15, he would par 16 and birdie 17, and all of a sudden, Stegmeier is walking down 18 with a three-stroke lead. A par would ensure a victory, and that's exactly what he does. Brett Stegmeier finishes 15 under and the 89th Connecticut Open champion. Yeah, definitely pleased. Um been trying to win this for quite a while. I played in it a lot when I was a kid, lost in a playoff in 2004. A little less pressure, tried to stay more patient, played really well the last two days, made a bunch of putts, and um, yeah, definitely, it's always nice to win a golf tournament. It's been, it's been a while since I've won one, and yeah, I really wasn't thinking about winning, just wanted to, I knew I'd have a bunch of looks at birdies, and um, just was hoping today was my day in the greens, which it was, and saw I was leading with a couple holes to go, and Kind of just had to hang on and didn't finish the way I would have liked, but made ended up making par. And yeah, I just tried to stay patient and give myself chances. I knew if I was just on the green the way I was rolling it, I'd have a good chance. So, and that's what I did. And um, you know, nobody in the final group made a, a big charge, so it was uh, it was good enough for the for the win.